Welcome guys, today, today I'll show you how to download LabyMod because that's my most viewed YouTube video. So just go to the description and press the first link to LabyMod. You, you can also just type in the search box LabyMod. Just go to the site. It's very easy to download. All you have to do is just go to the site, press on download or, or you can just download there. Just free download, It's easy. press keep and also you need to, you have, you need to download Java just to have this because otherwise it's, it's just weird so you press this you open it you open it with java platform you press ok so it pops up and then you can choose if you want to do 1.12 or 1.8 i personally need 1.8 you can choose if you want to play it on forge or on, on vanilla so it, it makes an own minecraft launcher thingy so then you press next and they have all these add-ons people ask me always oh, how do i all how do I add all of these add-ons uh, all you have to do is just press on them it's so complicated right just press on them just just press on them it's so hard look at him I'm left clicking left clicking it's working okay I'm just making too much fun of my subscribers okay let's if you have let's see let's let's suppose you have four you have four you're using forge too and you have all of these fancy mods you want to use in lay mode. You can't see like mouse delay fix or your all your other stuff. You just press add all this all the files. You get all your mods. My mod folder is on on my desktop. As you can see, it's 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 right it's right here. Where is it? Wait, this this is what it is. So you go down there. You just press it and then you double click. I mean, and then you press Control on your keyboard and press every single one of them. Left click all of them and then press open and then if you look here everything is added so all you need to do now is press install it's adding everything it's adding the optifine it's adding everything out every fancy stuff all the fancy stuff you need and then lay mode successfully installed so press ok you go to minecraft you close out your chrome or something or whatever internet explorer so all you need to do now is just go here, press this little arrow, and then it says your lay mod 1.8.9. You press on that, you open it. It's opening, so this normally ta doesn't take too much too much time because this lay mod has all of their add-ons and mods installed in itself. So this usually doesn't take long. It's much less than Forge because in Forge you have to download every single mod into it. So it's opening now. I'm n now in game. You go to options, then you see another tab with Lady Mod settings. <coughs> if you want to enable your add-ons, you go to install Lady Mod add-ons, and then you can change if you want your scale to be large or not. I don't want a large one. I don't want damage indicator right now. I put more particles usually on four, so I can get actual particles and I love particles. That's why. And also Optifine is installed, so you can actually get more FPS out of it. You can get more settings. You can turn off stuff. I have I have Minecraft maxed out. So this, these are my settings, and my this is my FOV. If you want to know, I, I know it's it's not it's not important. Okay. So if you want, these are all also stuff you can turn off. If you want the 1.7 sword, you can just toggle this. If you want the 1.8 sword, you can fiddle around with this, and maybe you'll find something you you want. How you hold how you hold stuff, just inventory, everything, and this always turn turn this on. This is very important. This is like the mouse delay fix, but installed in labor mod. So always turn this on. If you don't turn this, this on, you'll have a very bad crosshair and you'll be very bad at PvP. I'll promise you. Look, it says fixes a bug that causes the crosshair movement to be delayed at 1.8. So do it. If you don't do this, you're going to lose every single fight you do. I promise you. I usually do, doesn't care, don't care about the confirm and disconnect button. You just turn it off. It's just much easier. And then I usually turn off these off too. I'll show them on my name that's a good one still and then the k priority and then and then that's that's kind of that's kind of it and you just go into your servers and like a cubecraft uh, and um, i normally don't go cubecraft and then you have this beautiful fps counter and everything and look how bad i'm lagging because i only have four gigs of ram why is this okay okay but this is a very great mod if you want to change all of these so if you're like me and you don't like this FPS counter and everything, you just go option, late mode settings and then in-game GUI. You press continue anyway. For information, you just turn off everything you don't want. 
I usually use the ping mod and I put it here and the um, what do I use the potion effects that that's also nice so you can just put it here so I think that's the video then I thank you guys for watching and subscribe to my youtube channel and goodbye